guys, so you know this weekend is July 4th weekend, so I'm actually doing a barbecue. But I'm not cooking all the food, but I'm cooking some of the major food that people find a little bit difficult. Meat on the steak, pork chop, pepper crab, and a big pot of pepper soup, and some donuts. So this is the first step I'm going to do. There's something about barbecue, before you put the meat on the grill or the pork chop, you always want to pre-steam it really good. Not overcook it, but you want to steam it really now good. I got my, I already seasoned my meat. This is number one, pot. And now I'm going to steam it down really good and add a little bit of salt to it. I use to season the meat. Actually, I use some bell pepper, hot pepper, smoked fish, um, onions, a little bit of so seasoning meat salt. and I got some peanut butter yes peanut butter put it in some warm water and mix it up in your meat so this is the I first thing this meat I'm not gonna do it I'm not gonna over steam it you're gonna steam it a little bit and I will add a little bit of sauce to it and a little bit of peanut butter to it then I'm going to put on the stick so you're gonna see that but now this is it This right here is for the pepper soup. This is the calf foot and calf skin and some beef you know chunk. I'm cooking it overnight because it's the most difficult thing to cook. It's very hard. It needs a lot of hours on the stove. So that's what I'm cooking you can it see right. I'm steaming the meat. So I'm turning it over real quick because I don't want for it to be too overcooked because it's going on the grill reason why you want to do this because it will cut down the grill time and when you put a raw meat on the grill it takes a long time to cook and then people get this sick what I'm doing and when I'm done I'm going to add some some of my season to it and a little bit of peanut butter and put it on the stick the final result for the meat This is the chicken about the go on the, will go on the grill. I'm just going to steam it before I put it on the grill. See, you don't want to overcook it. You just want to steam it a little bit. So I'm turning it over. I'm about to take it out of the pot pretty soon. The reason why you don't want to overcook it because it's going on the grill. And you don't want to overcook it. So you always want to steam it a little bit. This is the grilled fish. It's going on the ground. Let me see if I can show you how I did it. <laughs> Sneak peek. Season it already, and you're just going to put in an aluminum fork and just put it on your grill. And eat it some hot pepper. This is how the chicken supposed to look, and then you put it on the grill. I did a shrimp on the stick. You know, for the shrimp lover, not a lot of people eat shrimp, but this is what's going on the grill. We're just gonna place it right on the grill. This is the pepper crab. I'm adding a bottle of Hennigan into the crab. This is all I'm using to cook the crab. I'm going to let the crab to boil in the Hennigan, the beer. Before I add the salt, add the sauce. Ooh, hopefully it don't fall. I'm trying for nothing. But yes. Right now I'm adding the peanut butter to the pepper crab. This is the pepper crab. And that's all you need to do. I went ahead and did pepper sauce to go with the grilled fish, the grilled chicken, um, meat, and the pork chop on the grill. What's in the pepper sauce? Hot pepper, bell pepper, onions, smoked fish, and some seasoned salt. You can see I fry with a little bit of oil, a little bit of tomato paste to get that little orange look. Not a lot of tomato, just part of like a it's ready to eat with anything when it get cooled you can put it in a jar and you can take a little bit anytime you're about to eat your dinner it's the pork chop it's gonna be on the grill I'm gonna steam it down a little bit before I put it on the grill I'm going to steam it down add a little bit of sauce to it and it will be ready to hit the grill 
I seasoned it overnight and now I'm going to steam it down a little bit more before I the reason put it why I'm there. steaming it down a little bit that will cut some time off from the grill because you know a lot of people love grill food and you don't want to keep them waiting this is the like the easy process to do before you place any type of meat a chicken on your grill you always want to pre you always want to steam it down a little you want to steam it down a little bit not overcook it just steam it down and it has to start turning you and out it's ready you guys this is what I'm talking about like that you want all your meat to be just like that and you want to keep on stirring so this is what I was talking about as you can see I'm going to add the pepper on here I'm going to add the peanut butter African people with grill and peanut and butter it is ready for the grill it is ready for the grill